Catherine Ryan, 39, has slammed the outrageous Oscars crowd for applauding after Will Smith slapped Chris Rock live on stage last year. The comedian branded the controversial moment an assault while also calling the ceremony scripted due to the audience's theatrical response. Express.co.uk asked Catherine what she thought about the slap, nearly one year on since the outrageous Oscars moment. She said, well, I know that it's a very loaded slap and there are all these discussions that have branched out from it about like male friendships and about partnerships, and about open relationships, and couples, and dating younger and about, you know, the black community in general. And there have been so many discussions, which I think is really interesting. One event has such a butterfly effect that people are having discussions for years. Catherine then reiterated her anger at the Hollywood crowd's immediate response to the assault. She continued, I feel like getting assaulted by a colleague while you're at work in front of a room of people, who then applaud the man who slapped you in the face is outrageous. I think it sets a very dangerous precedent in comedy. I know mates of mine who've been hit or have drinks thrown at them in the basement of a pub. You don't have to be at the Oscars for something like that to happen to you. Catherine then shared her opinion on the scripted awards show, wishing she could have seen more natural reactions. She continued, they don't know who to be unless someone gives them a script. And I thought it was so funny to watch all of Hollywood, pause and look around like, oh, how are we meant to react to that? They don't have natural reactions. They don't know if it's set up or if it's part of the sketch. If we still like Will Smith, why did we stand and applaud? This comes as Chris broke his silence on the incident a year on in his live Netflix comedy special. He was praised for maintaining his composure following the incident. Catherine, however, shared how she believes Chris' response shows the dark moments of comedy in a perfect light. She continued, What's wonderful about being a comedian is you get to articulate yourself in the way that you want at the time that you want to, and has such a talented comedian. You know, I think it's a perfect example of when comedy can have some truth, and some dark moments, and some reflection, but also has still made it quite funny. I think it was edgy. It was a bit dangerous, some of the things that he said. But I think comedy is a wonderful way to express yourself much in the same way that Taylor Swift writes music about ex-boyfriends sometimes, you know, I think it's a great outlet. Ahead of the Oscars, Catherine is supporting Gal's Toes Flavor That Pops campaign, featuring a new show's topping menu of popcorn flavors, inspired by its best-selling recipes. Speaking on the campaign, she said, I love Gusto. We have a really organic relationship because my husband and I have been getting the recipe boxes since like 2018 or 2019, and it's just delicious adventurous food that you cook at home and not every recipe box is like that. This has us hooked, we don't even order takeaway anymore, it's been so good for the family, family mealtimes, and I love that they do flavors that pop for the Oscars because I stay home and I watch the Oscars with popcorn. It's a really good way to remind people about how many flavors there are at Gusto. So I was excited to collaborate on some of those flavors. Ahead of the Oscars, Catherine Ryan is supporting Gusto's Flavor That Pops campaign, featuring a new show's topping menu of popcorn flavors, inspired by its best-selling recipes. Visit https colon slash slash www.gusto.co UK slash blog slash five star flavor to grab your own free box, perfect for film-loving foodies.